colleagues, tech enthusiasts, and YouTubers. We're in my underground art studio. I've got my green screen back there that's uh, off the side for now, and then we've got cap in the background. So what we're going to talk today is about this awesome, awesome thing on technology called the flow page. So here we go. This is a flow page right here is my artist logo because this is for my art site but teachers this is going to be great for you guys so imagine you have a school g or a google or whatever so first we have to make the flow page before we can connect it but right here once they're on the flow page you could have this say school g or google classroom and this could say the classroom web page and this could say the classroom youtube really doesn't matter what it is but these are going to be links that whisk Whoever you want to go wherever you want. So how do you get that started here? So we're gonna go to the flow page. So let me pull up just a brand new window. Flowco.com. I think that's not gonna work. I need flow page. They kind of both intermingle with itself. Yeah, see I knew that was gonna pop up. So we're gonna do flowpage.com. And so what's gonna happen is you're gonna get this teal, yeah, this kind of color here. And you're right now you're gonna either sign in or put in your name here so i put my name in here that i wanted and hit enter and then i ended up signing in so we're going to go over here and so right here is my flow page is flow.page backslash darby's art room so what we're going to do is we're going to manage the links so we're going to hit add url i'm going to go over here to my art room i'm going to control a and that should be the bottom left most corner and then I hit control copy and then pop back over here and control V for paste. Hit the enter. I'm gonna type in class Weebly. And then I'm gonna hit save link. It's gonna do its thing. And then I'm gonna hit add another one. And this time I'm gonna hit the YouTube. I'm gonna hit control C because it was already highlighted. And then we hit Control V and hit the Enter. I'm gonna do Class YouTube. And hit Save Link, and we can keep going and going and going. Uh, yeah. So what we're gonna end up doing there? Now we're gonna hit this right over here where it says uh, the Flow page. We're gonna hit that, and that is gonna copy you down here. And then you're gonna go to your codes. Okay, click codes, and up pops this great thing. It's got my name right here. See, I've tried this multiple times. Uh, we're gonna hit create code. And so this is gonna work really well in a place where you have Chromebooks with cameras, iPads with cameras, phones, anything like that, wherever you wanna push customers, students, viewers. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna hit a website link, and we're gonna go right over here, and we are gonna hit paste or control paste. And we are going to hit next. And to unlock your free codes, please answer a few questions. Uh, I'm not going to do more right now. I don't want to do that. Okay, so we're going to hit next. Oh, boy. It's going to make me. Cool. Oh, yeah, you got to do all this mumbo jumbo uh, to unlock free codes and some free plan. And uh, I guess I'm gonna have to do that. Just do that. Da 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 da. Uh, da, da. da, da. Yay for filling out a form. Okay. All right. See, there was that Darby's best right there that I tried to do a couple minutes ago. Anyways, so. Create like we just did, and we'll drop in my next. Wait, and so this is what you were supposed to get. So you could choose the standard, or you could choose uh, that, or you can hit scan me. So I'm gonna hit scan me just in case um, some people don't know. You're supposed to pull out your phone and point your camera at it, and your camera will. Have an image with some words and say you want to go to this website and you hit yep and so sorry we'll hit create and so then download flow code 
spell code number one because I've done this already. Uh, right here is a PNG, so that means the background can be transparent. Um, and there's JPEG as well. Let me pop that up. Uh, sure, why not? And there you go. So now you can take this, you can print it out, you can put it on the outside of your door, uh, you can put it on your YouTube, uh, so it can people can get to your class website and everywhere else you want them to go. Um, I had uh, I did this, and then I added a like a graffiti art style poster, and I put this on it, and I put that on my Instagram, and at the end of all my videos or most of my videos. That way, if people want to scan it and go to other places um, as an artist, they can do that as well. So um, definitely helpful if you're trying to push people, uh, students in one way or the other. So once again, this is Darby saying uh, thanks for tuning in. If you have questions, uh, let me know. Look forward to seeing you in the halls and online. Take care. Stay safe.